I'm doing well in section tests. I'm doing well con separately, verbal separately, LRDA separately, but I'm not doing well overall. And so, to be very honest, this is, uh, I don't think doing well in sectionals should automatically translate to doing well in mock. They're whole different things. And so, sectionals never gives you the context. And so, sectionals you're taking for that intensity for a 40 minute hit. It never gives you the context of the pressure of a mock score. I had scored this many in the last three mocks. This one should be better, closer to the exam. I should be getting this. That whole context is gone, number one. Number two, fatigue is not a factor. Doing a 40 minute exam and three, doing three 40 minute exams back to back, they're wildly different things. And so, so I don't think this is translatable. You can't say, typically in a verbal section test, I, take, I get 25. Typically in quant, I get 32. Typically in LRDI, I get 20. So I should add all three up. That should be my typical uh, overall score. The math is not, it's not apples to apples. It's not oranges to oranges. That expectation, that sectional performance directly transfer, transition to overall mock is invalid. It's invalid because you don't account for fatigue. More than that, we don't account for the big picture. It's like playing in nets, which is playing in a real game. They're wildly different. So mock to mock, sectional to sectional. So what are sectionals there for? To to amp up one thing, to amp up intensity. So if you're really struggling in quant in the paper, that means you're, you're getting tired by the time you go to minute number 80, so you're not at your best in quant. If you do four section tests in quant, you kind of your mind says, doing 40 minutes of quant is not such a big deal. I can do it anytime. I can do it on minute one to 40, 41 to 80, or 81 to 120. This is not such a big deal for my brain. You're training your brain to think like that. So sectional tests play those roles. There you say, look, I'll amp this up because I'm finding a weakness here. I'm going to build my LRDI stamina. I'm going to do two back-to-back -back LRDI things because 80 minutes is super tough. At the 75th minute, if I'm still staring at the screen and trying to crack out a puzzle with 14 constraints, I can hang in there and I want to tell myself I can hang in there. So to tick those objectives, take sectionals. But sectionals to mocks, the link is not valid. Sectional to mock, the link is not valid because the context is not there and fatigue is not accounted for. So don't think that it, it extends directly like that. Uh, the, so, so keep mocks as a separate strand and sectional to fill specific gaps as and when they are expected.